Hi everyone, this is Camille. I'm so excited to see more and more of you guys start to edit videos with Video Prog Flagger. In today's tutorial, I want to share with you some small tricks to improve the editing efficiency, so you can add your storytelling effortlessly. Okay, let's get started. When making a video, we tend to prepare as many source files as possible, but end up using only a few of them. To avoid these unused files, stuffing up the media library and make it easier to manage our source files. We absolutely want and need to remove unused files. We can delete them one by one, but that's too time consuming. Actually, we can delete all unused files with a simple click. Let's find this icon on the upper left of the Media Library section. Select Delete Unused Files. Take a look. All of them are removed off. This can save us tons of time. Now we can make fun edits. When editing some wide videos, a wider preview window can bring us a better preview experience. We can drag our mouse over here to adjust the aspect ratio of the preview window. If we don't need the side panels, simply click on here. This can help us focus on the preview window. If we have more than one monitor, we can click on here to detach the preview window from the program. So we can open the preview window on another monitor. This can help us have a better preview. Suppose we don't have an extra monitor, we can click here to preview the video in full screen. Press Escape on the keyboard to go back to the regular view. When making a relatively complicated effect, there might be multiple clips stacked on the timeline. In this case, moving each clip one by one for adjusting the effect can be too troublesome. We can press Ctrl and left click the clips that we want to move. Right click the mouse and hold, then drag to select the clips we want to move. Once we select all these clips we need, left click on the mouse and drag. We can reposition it on the timeline. If we miss any clip or we are just not satisfied with the edits, we can click on here to undo the changes. We know that the order of the tracks in Video Prog Flagger determines how the clips are organized. The old school way to adjust multiple or all clips on a timeline track is to add a new overlay track and then move these clips in batch. However, we can get this done in an easier way. Left click on the mouse over here and then drag the track. We can move the entire track along with all the clips placed on it. Suppose we've applied lots of adjustments on a clip, but we're not satisfied with the outcome. We want to start all over again while still remaining the changes such as trim, split, color grid, and motion. 
we can reset all the edits we applied over here, the inspector panel, and click. Go to the upper right of this panel to find a Reset All. Click on it. We can undo all the changes we've done here. What's worth noting is, this can also restore our adjustments towards the speed. That's all for today's tutorial. Hope these tricks can help you edit videos in a more efficient way. If you want to know more editing tricks or what has been going on with Video Frog Flagger, be sure to click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel. See you in our next editing tutorial. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye!